Michael Kratzio serves as the director of the White House Office of Science and Technology Policy, and he joins us now. Good morning to you. Good morning. It's great Good to be here. Good morning. We saw her, what she did. She was a big advocate for Take It Down, for that act that took down the AI-generated naked pictures of young girls, that uh, they were fakes, and she helped get that, those down, and now she's doing this presidential AI challenge. What exactly is it, Michael? Yeah, it's a great moment for our country. Well, the president signed an executive order in April of this year and essentially prioritized AI education in K through 12. And the challenge is all about young Americans being able to team up together to develop and use AI solutions and AI tools to, great, to create great opportunities in their own local communities. So you can imagine students teaming up to create and use AI tools to do things like optimize bus routes, for example, uh, for their local school district, um, to maybe use large language models to help identify indigenous plants, maybe in their local um, gardens. You could help empower and, uh, and work with their local fire departments. So the opportunities are endless. But the key is we want to have America's youth plugged in and working on uh, and using AI tools.